El Camino Real is one of California's best known roads. And if you grew up here, you probably heard a story that goes something like this. Remember, it's the same road the Spaniards followed almost 200 years ago. Only they call it El Camino Real, King's Highway. Try and imagine how it looked then. You mean, with Spaniards on horseback? In your own mind's eye, yes. Legend has it, El Camino Real is an ancient road built by the Spanish to connect their 21 missions along California's coast. But what's the real story of this Camino? The Spanish, you know, often enough you read in textbook that they blazed trails, but they didn't blaze trails. They followed trails that had already been developed by the indigenous people up and down the California coast. Eventually they, they, they come to give these major paths the, the name that was given to all major roads in the Spanish Empire, Caminos Reales, Royal Roads, because technically everything belonged to the kings. The Spanish didn't build El Camino Real. They used trails built by indigenous people. And while they did give El Camino Real its name, there were many royal roads, not just one. This royal myth started circulating during the Spanish Revival Movement at the turn of the 20th century. It was a marketing campaign from the Automobile Club of Southern California that helped it spread. They created the notion that these missions were basically deliberately located a day's journey from each other to encourage people to buy cars, ride cars, buy gas, and in doing so, take the mission tour, then relive the founding of, of California, you know. It was all a fantasy kind of thing. This fantasy version of California history caught on in this state. And soon, many wanted to see the missions brought back to their former glory. A lot of them were in really sad shape. If you look at pictures from the 1860s and 1870s, the missions are, are crumbling. In many ways, the ad campaign worked. And without it, we might be looking at a string of ruins along the California coast. Instead, we're left with beautifully restored churches and the myth of El Camino Real that continues to be told today. You can learn more about the myth of El Camino Real on the Bay Curious podcast. Subscribe wherever you get your podcasts. Just search Bay Curious.